curious, what does that word devotion mean to you? What comes up for you when you hear that word devotion? I was thinking about that today because when I am getting ready for a show and I'm out and about, people are always going like, oh, you're so fit, or they, they comment a lot um, on the way I look when I'm getting ready for a show. Oh, you know, you must be really focused. You must have a lot of discipline. And I, and I laugh. It's kind of funny because I'm just not used to getting like that kind of attention, but it gets brought up a lot. And I was thinking about one aspect of us achieving any kind of goal, whether it's fitness, health, wellness, business, relationship, spiritual growth. Um, it's looking at this one aspect, which we think of as like willpower, the thing that's going to get us there. Like we see something, we want it, and we're going to go after it. So it's that driving force, that, that will, that willpower. Uh, the other aspect of it that I think is really important, and this is what came to me this morning, which was that ultimately uh, my will, my desire to be my best is actually centered in this inner sense of devotion. And I'm using that word devotion because I truly believe when we look up even up the word, what does it mean to devote? It means to commit to our highest and best self. It's that, that piece of us that if it's not fulfilled, if we don't attain it, then we will, uh, we will leave this planet, we will leave this earth with disappointment or regret. And I believe that all of us are given gifts, unique gifts, that we are here to devote ourselves to at some level. And a lot of our greatest um, feelings of anxiety or depression, um, not feeling fulfilled, is based on the fact that we're not addressing this longing within us that we all have, which is this devotion to self, our devotion to our purpose, devotion to God, our highest power, whatever that is for you. But what I would request, and what I'm asking for you, um, just as something to think about, is what does it mean if you were to devote your um, yourself to your calling, to you, and to what is uniquely you? And what kind of decisions will you make in this day that will be different, that it's not externally motivated by people complimenting you or saying good job, but really it's the internal motivator that gets you through the hardest times. For me, hunger, having to work out, the practice, um, I'm no spring chicken, um, growing a business, grieving the loss of my child. These are all things that I became a devoted person to. I became a disciple um, to my own process of healing, growth, and being the best I can here to be. So what are you devoted to? What is your commitment to yourself? It sounds so serious, and it kind of is, but this I will say to you, when you have that level of clarity on what you're devoted to, the sense of freedom, the freedom that so many people seek is there, is there for the taking. So today, think about what you're devoted to and what you're here to fulfill as your greatest mission in your life. Take good care. Thanks for tuning in.